Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel, which is the build 26227 for version 24H2. Of course, in this video, as always, we're going to talk about what is new, what has changed, and also what is fixed in this latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. In this build, Microsoft is introducing the Copilot experience as an app which will basically allow you to resize move and snap the window of copilot basically we've tested this before on other builds so not really anything interesting in particular and also microsoft is retiring the win plus c keyboard shortcut for copilot and for new devices that ship with a copilot key this key will open copilot microsoft is also adding support for emoji 15.1 which introduces a small number of brand new emojis such as head shaking horizontally and vertically phoenix lime and more you can check those out even on this build or on the official Microsoft website. Also in the settings app, you may start to notice a new linked devices settings page under settings and accounts that allows you to manage PCs and Xbox consoles that you are signed into with your Microsoft account. This will only show on Windows 11 Home or Pro editions. And of course, if you are signed into Windows with a Microsoft account. Also as spotted by Phantom Motion 3, we have some new settings that are moved from the old control panel to the new settings app. First of all, if you go to Bluetooth and devices and then mouse, you're gonna find this new option, enhance point under precision of course you can turn this on or off this was only available on the old control panel and we also have a new option scrolling direction where we can select the scrolling direction down motion scrolls down we have this selected when you scroll down the page will also scroll down and up will scroll up if you select otherwise down motion scrolls up if you go down it will scroll up and if you go up it will scroll down for me i'm used to down motion scrolls down but of course you can now change this really easily if you want directly from the settings app microsoft is also introducing a new feature inside phone link and this feature is called suggested replies with suggested replies you will see three contextually relevant reply bubbles to choose from when you receive a message this feature is turned on by default so you can start using it right away simply select a suggested reply and it will be sent immediately they also have a few fixes in this build microsoft fixed an issue believed to be the underlying cause of some insiders noticing stutters in some animations recently dropping frames particularly with task view they also fixed an underlying issue which could lead to some apps not starting on startup even though they were enabled as startup apps and settings it would show as suspended in task manager but not appear in the taskbar and also they fix an underlying issue which could lead to the pop-up asking for permission to use location not appearing which could lead to app issues without location access related to windowing microsoft fix an issue related to showing tabs in all plus tab which could lead to frequent explore.exe crashes if you had a large number of tabs related to widgets microsoft fix the issue causing win plus w keyboard shortcut to not work correctly and open the widgets board and they also fixed explore.exe crashes impacting live captions and voice access. We also have a known issue in this build for users that are stuck on certain builds, but Microsoft is currently investigating this and in the next few builds, everyone should be good. So basically, this was the latest build for the Canary channel, build 26227. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Jose Manuel from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.